Yeah, what's up you guys? This is Gasson coming back and we're continuing the series for our base build. Now, this was our Town Hall 6 if you remember, but now it's time to move on to Town Hall 7. And here it is. Bam! So now that we're Town Hall 7s, this is when all the action starts. And you gotta be careful because there are players out there that will go for your Town Hall. They will huff, puff, and blow your house down with their new hero. What's the matter, scared? Yes, we should be scared because this is when uh, usually people worry about trophies and a lot of new players that don't really care to farm are going to go after you and start attacking your trophies. Uh, now, I really don't care about that. I'm usually a farmer uh, when I was down at Town Hall 7, so I recommend you guys do that. But for the sake of this video, I will make a trophy-based layout for you because it just seems like the majority of people at Town Hall 7 are uh, trophy layouts. So this is uh, the trophy layout I had, but of course we get some new stuff in our uh, shop here. We got the hero, we got dark elixir, we got some new cannons, and another mortar with an air defense. So you guys, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade all this stuff. I'm going to try and get the king to level 5 and see what else they got for us. With all these new things in the shop, they also gave us an additional set of walls that we can upgrade and add to our base. Now Town Hall 7's are when all the fun starts because you get your hero and you get your Teslas as well as your Dark Barracks. It's just a lot of fun. Uh, when we started playing Clash of Clans when it first came out we did not have all this stuff so you guys have a lot of perks. And also being a Town Hall 7 means you're in the sweet spot if you're trying to farm. Really good loot at this town hall, which a lot of people did not know. If you upgraded your town hall, you get a loot penalty. So I recommend you guys stay at this level if you're trying to farm until you're fully maxed out. So let's go ahead and do a speed build, you guys. I will be right back. All right, and we're back. Now we're finishing up the last touches of our Town Hall 7 base design. Uh, some people might have a problem with this design. However, I've carefully looked over every wall. And uh, of course, you know, you don't get a lot of walls for being at Town Hall 7. Uh, you get a few more when you're at Town Hall 8. So I really can't connect everything, but I'm making the most of what they're giving me. Now, the reason why I'm putting everything the way it is is because I like to center my Dark Elixir, my Town Hall, and my Clan Castle, which are the three most uh, crucial things in the game for you to have guarded and to protect while you're upgrading or while you're defending. Now, of course, you could actually put your uh, pumps and mines on the sides where those wizard towers are, but I just like to have it this way uh, because I have a mortar to back up any other troops that they um, spam on the outside out there. Now, you guys, you will notice that a lot of troops that people will be using around this level are balloons and minions. Usually farmers are what are going to attack you if they're going for your um, dark elixir right here in the center. So I like to have my air defenses protect my dark elixir as well as my town hall. Now I know my storages are all maxed up. However, you won't have to do that. Uh, as soon as you get some gold, you could spend it right away and keep your storages at a lower level because a lot of these upgrades don't really take that much to, to purchase, to buy with the gold that you get from raids. So I think Dark Elixir is pretty much the most valuable thing that you are going to have to protect at this level because people want that stuff. And also, if you notice my uh, my army camps, they should be at a lower level. How, however, I'm using the developer iPad, so they are a little higher up, which you won't be able to get them that high. Um, so I'm just giving you guys a heads up. So just make sure you guys put as many things as you can inside the walls, which should up 
your defense a bit. And that's what I did for this Town Hall 7 base design. Hope you guys like it. Let me know what you think. And I will see you guys next time. Godson out.